Why eat healthy? Healthy eating is important for a lot of reasons. Most of us are already aware of the increasing obesity epidemic in North America. This is particularly true of the United States in general. There is even a phrase for the way many Americans eat, and that is called the SAD diet. SAD stands for Standard American Diet, and it refers to a diet low in vegetables, high in fat and sugar, and lacking in nutrition. Processed foods are definitely a part of the SAD diet. These are foods that are easily available and quick to consume and prepare but have long-lasting negative health effects. If you do not want to find yourself obese, it is generally considered a good idea to avoid eating such processed foods and keep your focus on eating whole grains and fruits and vegetables and meat that has not been treated with hormones and other chemicals that can ultimately end up in your body and cause issues. Understanding your relationship with food over the course of time, everybody begins to develop certain habits. We develop habits in all arenas of our lives. We develop hygiene habits, food habits, work habits, and all sorts of other types of habits. However, they are usually pretty oblivious to our habits until they begin to affect us negatively. And even then, when we begin to understand that we are being poorly impacted by our habits, it can be very difficult to change them. Because that is what I have it is like. A habit is something that we do almost unconsciously. We are programmed to follow these habits, and it takes a great amount of willpower to break free from the cycle. Once you begin to understand that your relationship with food has everything to do with the habits that you have created and habits that you can continue to mold and cultivate, then it becomes far easier to change your mindset. When you realize the click here to access the healthy eating video course. Impact and importance of your future and making positive choices about these things, it can make you more primed toward healthy eating and less inclined to make choices that negatively impact you in your future. To be truthful, many of us seem to consider the future bleak. We do not see reasons enough to change our habits because if we do not believe that we have anything good to look forward to, then it doesn't matter whether we make good choices or not. We do not see how we can actually pave our future to be in our best interests. Probably because we do not believe that we have any power over our lives. If you can relate to this feeling, don't be alarmed. It is very common of the human experience. We are generally discouraged from taking control and utilizing our power from an early age, and sometimes stop believing we have any authority over our lives because we are usually told what to do by other people. The dangers of diet trends Diet trends are rampant in our society today, and almost all of them come with dangers attached to them. Unfortunately, most people who are desperate to make money often don't look at the long-term health consequences of their products. What they are truly concerned about is making money and doing something that will help them to capitalize off of a desperate desire that many people have to lose weight in a fast and easy way. There is something that you are going to have to accept if diet trends are something that captivate your interest. The unfortunate fact of the matter is that there is no healthy way to lose weight fast and easily with no work and no healthy eating and no exercise. Losing weight is a good goal if you are obese or if you are lacking in fitness and you need extra mobility. All of us have at times needed to start making better lifestyle choices, and that is something that we can do with food and healthy body movement as opposed to by trusting companies that want to exploit us in order to make money. The food pyramid most of us have probably seen the food pyramid. Growing up, the food pyramid was often used as a guideline for us to provide us with an idea of how much food and what kind of food we should eat every day in order to maintain a healthy lifestyle. Of course, there is always evidence to state that the food pyramid is flexible, but overall, if you are able to observe the food pyramid you will have a general idea of what is acceptable in a healthy and nutritious diet. While this may sometimes be controversial, it is still good to have a basic food. Possibly one that you create yourself. A lot of people will say that it is no longer considered the most healthy thing to do to eat as many grains as the food pyramid may have suggested. The standard food pyramid recommends as follows, rice, cereal, pasta, and bread, can be as many as 11 servings per day. For vegetables and fruits, you should have between 3 and 5 servings. As far as their eggs, you can have two or three servings every day, provided you are not allergic or lactose intolerant. When it comes to meat and beans, and other things like nuts and fish or poultry, it is recommended that you have two or three servings every day. Unsurprisingly, things such as sugar and fat and oil are the very tip of the because you should not have any of these things in excess. Rather, use them only as necessary in order to guarantee your healthiest possible lifestyle.